Let's install custom fonts on every Samsung and every One UI. Hello everyone, it's Miros. Welcome to my channel. Today I will show you how you can install any font on your Samsung device using Android 10 or Android 11 and every version of One UI. Before we start, be sure you are already subscribed to my channel and hit that bell icon so you never miss a video. Let's jump in. Probably you remember before years you can install any custom font on your Galaxy device but now it's impossible. Let's check in settings what we have available now. Here we have font style and we have default Samsung One, Gothic Bolt and you can download more from Galaxy Store. But today I will show you how you can install any TTF font. And that's something big because you can find TTF fonts everywhere on internet and you can find every font that you want. Alright, let's just continue forward. To do all this we need to open our browser and of course XDA developers. And now we need to thank that guy. Satish Tony, thanks mate for doing that. Basically he created an APK which is mono and we did we can install custom TTF fonts. So you just need to scroll down the tree and here is the version mono 2.1. Just tap on it, download and of course install. When it's downloaded select open and install it of course give permissions to chrome to install the applications and select install all right application is installed let's just open it give it permissions of course give it permissions to install applications and it will also ask for permissions to read your storage because it can't install fonts without this go back and it's written on the top works on both Android 10 and Android 11. Now guys, first there is a steps what you need to do. First step is your Samsung account must be signed in. So if you are not already just go to settings and you can see now I'm signed in system hacks account. And if you are not just create one or just sign in with your account. We are ready with the first step, let's check the second one. Install Samsung Sans, ignore if already installed. Select. Do you want to install this application? Yes, why not? Probably you have it already installed on your phone, but it's not a problem to install it again. Third step, select Samsung Sans font. Tap here and select Samsung Sans. Fourth step, backup settings to your Samsung Cloud. Here, if you tap backup, and it will, it will open your Samsung Cloud application. Here it's even asking for update, I will just update it. It's ready, my Samsung Cloud is ready. Let's go back again and check what exactly is written here. Backup settings to your Samsung Cloud. That means you need to backup only settings to your Samsung Cloud. Nothing more, nothing less, only settings. And guys, if you can't launch Samsung Cloud for some reason, maybe Snapdragon devices can't launch it, just download from Play Store Activity Launcher and write there Cloud in the search box and it will appear and just launch it. That's it. Alright, let's just tap here on backup, deselect everything and select only settings. Select backup. All data backed up. We are ready here. Done. And let's go back. Now, let's continue with the next step. Custom font installation. Select TTF file. Copy TTF files to monofonts TTF folder. Alright, let's go to our home screen and open our file manager. Internal storage. I already download some TTF fonts. Of course, I will include zip file in video description so you can download 
the fonts which I select for you and if you want to download a separate fonts Google is full of these TTF fonts all right let's go to download directory fonts I will just select this one FFF just copy it go back to internal storage go to this folder mono fonts and this folder TTF tap on it and just select copy here that's it now let's back to the application select TTF load TTF load.fff TUSJ it's loaded install custom font uninstall and install it select install Samsung Sans do you want to uninstall this app ok and it will ask you to install new Samsung Sans which is our FFF font masked as Samsung Sans just select install select default default go back and now fourth step restore settings from Samsung Cloud select restore it will load your Samsung Cloud and select restore and you can see now my font is restored and I'm using this FFF font select done now I'm using this font let's go in settings you can see it's very different and now guys we can use all the fonts that we want with just this simple application and just this simple method now guys let's just select another font so we can just repeat the whole process and you will use it with it go to your file manager internal storage select the fonts which you downloaded i will select that one druid sounds select move and move it to that folder mono fonts and ttf move here all right it's already done now let's go to mono application and go to custom font installation select the font that you want here it is draw it sans all right it's okay install custom font and uninstall it tap install do you want to uninstall okay and install again we are ready with step two select default tap select you can see it's now samsung sans go to default scroll down again and restore settings from samsung cloud select restore and tap on restore button and you can see my font is already changed so i'm now using Drip sans select done and you can use your new font that's it guys if this video was helpful for you don't forget to subscribe my channel and like my videos thanks for watching and have a nice day